Um, my call to other ladies or other women, I understand most people say we are enemies of ourselves. Like we are too envious of one another, we don't like to see another one coming up. I don't think it's a true story. However, I would request that let's not have negative competition. Let's have positive competition even when we are dealing with our political seats, when we are dealing with other seats also. There are very many leadership roles, not only in politics. So let's wake up, ladies. I remember when we started campaigning even for this women's seat, and we kept saying that we have very few uh, um, uh, people who need to be elected in the other areas. And the men would ask us, but where are they? And it was true. No, women's, no women were coming up for elections or for leadership positions. But now what I would request is that let's hold hands as women so that we, we negate that narrative that we don't like to see another woman coming up. And let's stop feeling pity for ourselves. We are able. So let's go out like the men do. They don't care whether they are defeated. They try again and again because they are confident. Even us as ladies. There's a little girl, Mwashimu Toto. She didn't have any money. So it's not about money. It's about, about the leadership that you want to show and about uh, yourself. How do you carry yourself? Are you able to... Can you be trusted with leadership? So my fellow ladies, I'm asking that we conduct ourselves in a way that even the gentlemen will not point fingers at us like we are not good leaders.